Well, the issue of gun control made its way into the Henderson County Commission meeting tonight. A group called on commissioners to enact a ban on the sales of assault weapons. But those people weren't the only ones who were there to voice opinions about an emotional issue. News 13's Frank Crocker attended the meeting, and he joins us now. Frank. The last month's school shootings in Connecticut have clearly sparked nationwide debate about what, if anything, should be done about assault weapons. Tonight came proof that all politics is local. I'd like for all the people that are here for this particular resolution to stand. Thank you. But it was a crowd divided. <laughs> Over a resolution calling for a ban on all sales and purchases of semi-automatic weapons and ammunition clips that hold more than 10 shells. The definition of assault weapon is nebulous at best and a moving target. Assault is a behavior. It is not a device. Assault weapons were built for the battlefield, ordered by the military for the purpose of assaulting, for the purpose of killing as many people as possible, as fast as possible. The Department of Peace and Nonviolence Advocates had already brought this controversy before Hendersonville City Council. Tonight, there were more people in attendance and a much more mixed reaction. Those of us supporting the resolution before you believe that the growing number of weapons similar to the one I carried in Vietnam is a threat to all of us. We'll not stand down if you try to pass laws like this. We will fight you to the bitter end. Please act now if you can. If you cannot, then at least speak out against these weapons of mass murder. Solving our society's violence problems requires a great deal more work than passing a pointless law. Let's get to it. And after comment from more than a dozen people, the commission had its say. When the federal government passes the law, really, I personally think we have enough laws on the books. I think, you know, this needs to be reinforced or whatever. Uh, we will not be uh, making any decision on, uh, on this issue. There are local assault weapons bans being proposed all across the country, but it appears few, if any, will be successful. Gun control advocates, or they're instead looking to Washington and the political push there right now following the Sandy Hook tragedy.